Hello my sweetie cutie and lovely math lovers. Today I brought an interesting math challenge for you. Here as you can see left hand side is x over x minus 2 plus 1 over x minus 4. This is the left hand side and right hand side is 2 over x square minus 6x and plus 8. So we have to find out the value of x from this entire equation. If you think a little bit of this mathematical problem, it becomes so simple. If you want to solve by yourself, just pause this video and try by yourself and tell me what's the value of x or just follow the rest of the video. First, you have to think where you should start. This is very important to solve any mathematical equation. Look at left hand side. This denominator on the first parameter is x minus 2 and denominator on the second parameters is x minus 4. So if I work on this denominator on right hand side, somehow I will get maybe x minus 2 and x minus 4. So let's first start with this, this denominator on right hand side part. Let's rewrite the left hand side once again. x over x minus 2 plus 1 over x minus 4 and right hand side nominator is exactly 2 and denominator I will be working out. I will be working out like this way. x square here this 6x can be rewrite as 4x minus 2x. That means minus 4x and minus 2x is equal to minus 6x, right? And remaining is plus 8. And next statement is left hand side remaining the same x over x minus 2 plus 1 over x minus 4 is equal to 2. If I take 1x common from here and remaining is x minus 4. And from last two parameters, I can take minus 2 common. In that case, it becomes x minus 4. And next statement becomes exactly the same. x over x minus 2 plus 1 over x minus 4. Left hand side. And from here, x minus 4, first parameters. And from the second parameters, also x minus 4. We can take 1x minus 4 common. Nominator is exactly 2. And if I take x minus 4 common, it becomes x minus 2 and x minus 4. Look at here on left hand side first parameter has x minus 2 and second parameter also has x minus 4 but on the right hand side x minus 2 and x minus 4 so they have some correlation left hand side uh, denominator x minus 2 and x minus 4 in that case this nominator x will be multiplied by x minus 4 plus this one will be multiplied by this x minus 2. Hopefully you know how does it happening and right hand side remaining exactly same at it as it is that means 2 over x minus 2 multiplied by x minus 4. Now here is the interesting thing on left hand side this denominator x minus 2 multiplied by x minus 4 which is exactly same as the denominator of right hand side x minus 2 and x minus 4. What does it mean? Whenever the nominator or denominator are exactly same from left hand side and right hand side, they cancel each other. That means we can remove this denominator and that denominator from both hand side. What does it mean? It means this x multiplied by x minus 4 plus 1 multiplied by x minus 2 left hand side and right hand side is 2 multiplied by x is x square minus 4x plus 1 times x means x minus 1 time minus 2 means minus 2 minus 2 is equal to right hand side becomes 0. Now x square minus 4x plus x means minus 3x minus minus 2 minus 2 means minus 4 is equal to 0. Now I can rewrite this equation like this way. x square minus 4x plus x minus 4 is equal to 0. I need more space. Let's make it more shorter. Now from this first two parameters x square minus x I can take one x common here. That means if I take a common x, it remaining x minus 4. And here I can take one common. 
that means here also x minus 4 which is equals to 0 now again from this first parameter this x minus 4 and from the second parameters x minus 4 they are common so i am taking x minus 4 common remaining is x plus 1 it means there is two solution look at here x minus 4 and x plus 1 which is equals to 0 it means this x has two solution one solution is either x minus 4 is equal to 0 or x plus 1 is equal to 0 so for first case if x minus 4 is equal to 0 that means x is equal to 4 or x is equal to minus 1 question is which solution is correct x is equal to 4 or x is equal to minus 1 let's check it out here if x is equal to 4 then this equation becomes 6 see here 1 over 4 minus 4 that means 1 over 4 minus 4 is equal to 0 so these parameters become undefined that means undefined plus something that is also not valid for what that what does it means if x minus 4 is equal to 0 that means it is not a solution that means x is equal to 4 it cannot be a solution ultimate solution is if x is equal to minus 1 what will happen in this equation minus 1 divided by minus 1 minus 2 plus here 1 divided by minus 1 minus 4 1 divided by minus 1 minus 4 this is left hand side and right hand side become 2 over minus 1 whole square minus 6 minus 1 plus 8 this is the condition so in that case 1 over 3 minus 1 minus 4 minus 1 minus 4 means minus 5 this minus is here that means 1 over 5 this is left hand side right hand side become 2 here minus 1 is square means 1 minus 6 minus 1 is plus 6 plus 8 that means here will be 5 minus 3 over 15 is equal to 2 over 1 plus 6 7 7 plus 8 is equal to 15 so here also 5 minus 3 is equal to 2 over 15 is equal to 2 over 15 so if one if x is equal to minus 1 then left hand side is equal to right hand side that means this is the answer that means x is equal to minus 1 look at here this equation is looking complex but if, if you start with the right approach this answer becomes so simple this calculation becomes so simple that means mathematics is really interesting only you have to know where you have to start from that is the tricks thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe this channel it will help me and it will help you to find my new videos thank you so much see you in my next video bye bye